Hey guys, what's going on? Oh, uh, yeah, you, you guys have heard of the show on TV, uh, Life Below Zero. Well, this show here, Steve O's show, is going to be today, uh, Life Above 100. Yeah, mm -hmm. welcome to Florida. Yeah, here I am. <clears throat> Here, and, and I'm all in my monkey suit, as you can see. Not the easy going to get it beekeeping. And I'll show you why in a minute. I've got this excluder. I had to modify it for the old Stevo beefy beehives. And uh, there's that. We'll show you what we're going to do with that in a minute. <coughs> got to show you this here. Oh, look. What flavor do you want? <coughs> what flavor do you want, guys? You want chocolate or vanilla? Huh? What do you want? steve has got it all going on for you. All right, let's get back here in a minute, and I'll show you what we're going to do. It's time. It's time to take out the wicked witch of the West. And why would I say that? Because I'm on the West Coast. All right? That's what's going on. I'm on, I'm on the West Coast. And I've got a wicked witch that we have to terminate. Uh, let's just call her what it is. Let's just call her Nancy, okay? All right, that's enough of that comedy, Steve. All right, see you in a few. Okay, guys. The giggle games is over with this girl here. Uh, you know... Back in the day, even back in the 60s, I worked some very vicious bees. They say that they say the Africans came in in the 80s. I think they were slipping in before that. I came there this morning to change, just to take a peek under this lid. And man, and I even had a veil on, you know. Oh, these, these girls here said, no, we're going we're gonna to kick your ass, Steve. They are pouring out of here like crazy. So, it's time for the Wicked Witch to die. I want to go through this colony as we go. And hopefully I can find her. Hopefully I can find her. But what I want to do is strip this thing all the way down, even that bottom board. I want to get that off of there and put another bottom board. I'm going to shift all these girls back here in this opening. Back in the day, I was, like I said, I worked vicious bees, but I'm not selling bees to hobbyists. I'm selling, I'm making honey, right? So who gives a rip if you got mean bees or not? I didn't care back in the day. Didn't care. I'm making honey and I'm out in the boondocks where I can't hurt nobody. I was in bear country too, that might have been a plus. The bees, some of the bees I had back in the day to eat the face right off a bear. Eat the face off a bear, baby. All right, what do we got here? Let's look around on this floorboard. Let's look at this floorboard. Just give these a tap right here. Set this back here. Let's put this on here.
Let's put an excluder on. Yeah, the mission here, the mission here, guys, is to find the Wicked Witch. I need a funnel. Here's a funnel right here. Here's our funnel. got us a funnel now the object here guys the object here is to put all these beads in this box one frame at a time look at all them mean nasty bees everybody in the everybody in the hole it's show time today is what Tuesday Today's Tuesday, right, I want to find this wicked witch and kill her. Don't want to kill all of her sisters. I need, I need her sisters. But I want to look over every frame here. Hopefully we'll get lucky and find the old wicked witch and pinch her nasty little head off. Nice little gob of honey. They do make, they do make some good comb. But I'm not going to tolerate this nonsense. I cannot tolerate this nonsense. Where, oh, where is our wicked witch? Where are you hiding today? You must be terminated. I am Arnold Schwarzenegger today. I'm the Terminator. You must die. I'm not killing all of her. I'm not going to kill all her little flying monkeys now, guys. Don't misunderstand me now. I need all of her flying monkeys. I could find her quick guys and make my job so much easier. So much easier. We'll come back. We gotta find her. We have to find her. If we don't this nonsense just keeps on going. And like I said, uh, I don't want to sell these ugly things to a Is a beekeeper just starting out, you want to eat him alive. Of course, when I started out, I was getting eaten alive. I think I was tougher back in them days. I don't know, guys. Seems like the older I get, the more um, the heat 
gets me. See all this drone brood here too, guys? Let's kill all them things. Why are you doing it, Steve? Why are you killing them boys? Because them boys I just killed right there are her boys. Yeah. That's her boys. Right there, see them? Them little fatty ones? Take them out. Look at that, more swarm cells. Let's get rid of them too while we're at it. Don't need any more of her ugly sisters. guys see if we can push him through that exploder we have got to find that wicked witch where is my wicked witch And if these things swarm off, now you've got a now you've got a nasty swarm in the jungle out here. Within breeding breeding uh, room of these of these colonies I'm trying to raise. So that ain't fun either. That's not helping the situation, you know? Well, these, these uh, bright orange drones are faking me out. <laughs> They're just trying to fake me out, guys. This would be a good one for her to be on right here. Look at the pattern, guys. She lays, she lays an outstanding pattern. And I would not kill this queen if I was in honey production. Because she makes honey. I would not kill this queen. And all these pollinator guys, they're running around from here to here to California and back in two. They don't care. They'll run these hot bees all day long. They just don't care. And if I was in pollination game, I wouldn't care either. Am I getting them cranky, guys? What do you think? Are we having fun yet? You guys haven't got you guys haven't got stung yet, have you? Okay. This is kind of stuff you guys got to think about when you're raising bees. What is their disposition? They 
really stressing out right now. They're stressing out big time. She's a sneaky one, I'm telling you guys. She's a sneaky little Nancy. Sneaky Nancy. Mm -hmm. You guys know what Nancy I'm talking about too, don't you? Hey, call it for what it is, you know? If you're nasty, you're nasty. I can't help it. I can't help it that Nancy's nasty. There's nice things in this world and then there's mean things in this world. We just have to accept it and deal with it. Frame here is heavy, guys. This slap full of nectar. Slap full of nectar. Where are you, you wicked witch? Starting to draw that comb nice. That's that fresh comb I put in there the other day. Of course, when you're feeding, when you're feeding it, uh, they really kick them up a notch. Here's a good frame here she could be crawling on. for the bad angle guys I gotta tilt this box up here
she's a sneaky one guys she's a sneaky one Guys, I'm gonna cut this camera a minute and keep hunting. And I'll get back. I have not found her yet, guys. I'm hunting. Sneaky one, guys. She's a runner. Very sneaky. They can sting through these Playtex gloves too. But they can't bury the stinger and you, you can feel the bite of the sting, but. <laughs> deer skin works good. The deer skin gloves you can get at uh, Date Ant and all, they work pretty good. Hopefully I've killed her with all this commotion I've done here. Here's what we're gonna do. Got one crawling in my ear. How he got in this monkey suit, I don't know. <coughs> Here's what we're gonna do. Reassemble. Reassemble. Better luck on Friday the 13th than I'm having today, guys. Oh well. All right. Excluder. Top box. Rest of the frames.
This is going to be a process here. I got them. I got them here. I got them next door. I got them all over. Yeah. <sighs> Be kind of cool if I could find her crawling around on the ground here. I guess I'm going to give up. <laughs> if I say I'm going to give up, maybe she'll pop out of here and show her ugly little face. Needle in a haystack, guys. If she was a bright yellow queen, she's probably dark. And that's why she's not jumping out at me. Oh well. flying monkeys to chill out. Of course they won't be chilled out for days. 
I've got them all cranked up. Look at this hive over here. It's all pissed off now. I've got everybody upset. Isn't that nice? I got this whole yard stressed out, guys. But that's my job. Alright guys, that's enough shenanigans for one day. We weren't successful, but that's the way it goes sometimes. Uh, let's wait. Let's leave these flying monkeys for about five days, six days. Come back. Go back in here and see which which one has got eggs in it and who's got cells in it. If we find cells, we're going to crush them. I'm going to crush them and then whatever box got eggs in it, we got to go through that really with a fine tooth comb to find that queen. Yes, sir. All right, guys. Be happy. Be strong. We gotta keep getting it on.